Little about dentistry. Dentistry is the branch of medicine that is involved in the evaluation, diagnosis, prevention, and surgical or non-surgical treatment of diseases, disorders, and conditions of the oral cavity, maxillofacial area, and the adjacent associated structures and their impact on the human body. Therapeutic dentistry includes such chapters propedeutic course preventive dentistry in endodontology, periodontology, oral pathology deals with oral mucosa diseases. Basic instruments. There are a few basic instruments that are universal to almost every procedure in dentistry. Hand instruments. Working ends of instruments are the Functional parts of the instrument can have a variety of functions including cutting, packing, carving, placing and condensing are adapted to the function of the particular instrument may be beveled i.e. the working end is cut at an angle. An instrument can be single-ended one working end or double-ended two working ends shank of an instrument. The part between the working end and the handle can be straight or angled. The function of the instrument determines the angle and exability of the shank. Handle of an instrument is the part of the instrument that the operator grasps. Design is related to the function of the instrument. Set of examination instruments, mouth mirror, functions to provide indirect vision, to re-ECT, light, for retraction and protection of oral tissues, for magnify cation, the number of the mirror represents size of mirror head. Sickle, contra-angled probe, functions, detection, of, defective pits and fissures, calculus, deficient margins of restorations, crowns, and bridges, carries, examination, pointed tip allows good tactile, sensitivity, varieties can be single-ended or double-ended, many different styles, available, working ends may vary, straight, curved, periodontal probe, function in, Features measure the depth of periodontal pockets. Tip is calibrated in millimeters blunt and reduces the possibility of tissue trauma varieties, single-ended or double-ended. Can be straight, curved or at right angles. Plastic types available. College. Tweezers. Functions placing small objects in the mouth and retrieving small objects from the Mouth, locking type, lock to prevent dropping materials varieties, locking in, non-locking types. Working ends can be straight, curved, serrated or smooth. Instruments used in basic restorative procedures. Spoon excavators functions and feature a spoon-shaped working and for spooning out dentinal caries from the cavity preparation. Edges of working end are sharp. Any remaining caries will be removed with a conventional handpiece and a round burr. Mixing spatulas. Function and feature. Used to mix dental materials. Anodized aluminium. Spatula will not stick to any composite materials or discolor materials. Flat plastic. Instrument. Also called plastic instrument functions to deliver materials to the cavity. Preparation to remove excess materials varieties various sizes and shapes available can be single-ended or double-ended. Round-ended plastic functions and feature used to create anatomical shapes in composite material during restorations. The ball-ended plastic instrument can also be used to pack and condense composite materials. Rotary instruments, handpieces in BURS dental handpieces and rotary attachments help to make dental treatment more comfortable for the patient and reduce the amount of time needed to complete procedures. Air turbine, handpiece, also called fast handpiece, high-speed handpiece, air rotor, handpiece type contra-angled functions precaution and features removal of tooth tissue during Restorations and preparation of teeth for FIXED prosthetic appliances polishing of restorations. High speeds create heat and friction. Handpiece must be run with water to cool the tooth to prevent palpal damage. High speed saves treatment time and reduces vibration. Driven by turbine may need to be lubricated. Check manufacturers. Instructions Compressed air rotates the turbine, which then rotates the burr speed check. 
manufacturers specify cations can run up to 500,000 revolutions per minute grip except friction grip. Attachments Attachment dental unit varieties Different types of chucks available, e.g. those which need burr changing tool, with or without light smaller heads for DIF by cult. Access Straight handpiece Functions Used in surgical procedures to remove bone Cannot use Air turbine as the water is not sterile, used extra orally at chairside or in the dental laboratory, e.g. for denture adjustments, speed can run up to 40,000 revolutions per minute grip except long shank. Attachments Attachment electric motor that phytias into the base of the handpiece. Slow speed. Handpieces. Type contra-angled functions, removal of caries polishing, procedures that Require torque, refine a cavity preparations and adjust occlusion driven by gear speed. The speed of the handpiece ranges from 0 to 40,000 revolutions per minute. Attachment electric motor that phytias into the base of the handpiece. Burrs. Head. This is the working end. Function depends on the size and shape of the head. Many different sizes and shapes, each used for a different function. Cutting. Polishing and finishing, neck, the part that connects the head to the shank, usually narrows towards the head shank, the part that phytias into the handpiece, shapes and lengths vary. Depending on function, can sometimes be marked to identify burr type, stripes or colored bands. Some points to remember about rotary attachments and burrs, most often called burrs but also available are wheels, discs, rubber points, rubber cups, and stones. Each has a particular function. Cutting, polishing, finishing or carries removal are made from various materials. Tungsten carbide, diamond and steel can have utes. The cutting edges the end of the shank determines which handpiece the attachment will fit into. Long straight shank, straight handpiece. Latch grip, conventional type, slow speed handpiece, friction grip, shank air turbine handpiece, high speed handpiece, other various attachments such as snap or screw type attachments, shape and function, shape determines function, the examples that follow, relate to tungsten carbide burrs, rose head round cutting and removing carries pair. To shape the cavity preparation fissure, to shape and prepare the cavity preparation grip, and corresponding handpiece, refers to the way the burr's shank is gripped into the handpiece composition, refers to the head of the burr and what it is made from. Generally, most latch grip burrs are made of steel. Most phi CTION grip burrs are made of tungsten carbide or Diamond. Most long shank burrs are made from steel if they are meant for surgical procedures in stainless steel if they are meant for laboratory purposes. Anatomical and histological features of teeth. 1. In adult humans there are 32 permanent teeth. 2. These are preceded during childhood by 20 deciduous teeth. 3. The tooth lies in a bony socket, the alveolus, that is covered in oral mucosa called the gingiva comes tooth structure enamel structure of enamel enamel is made up of millions of enamel prisms or rods which run from the amelodental junction to the enamel surface each prism is made up of a large number of enamel crystallites dentine structure of dentine dentine consists of many dentinal tubules that run parallel to each other following a double curved course, and extend from the pulp to the amelodental junction. Each dentinal tubule contains an odontoblast process surrounded by intercellular ground substance composed of fine collagenous fibrils. The odontoblast cells are a layer of closely arranged cells on the palpal surface of the dentine with their nuclei situated at the basal palpal end of each cell. Cementum. Physical characteristics of cementum. Cementum is a pale yellow, calcified tissue covering the root dentine. It is softer than dentine and can easily be worn away, resulting in exposure of the dentine. Its thickness varies according to location. It is thickest towards the apical third of the root and thinnest cervically. 
chemical composition of cementum cementum is 65% by weight in organic mainly hydroxyapatite 23% organic mainly collagen and 12% water dental pulp the dental pulp is surrounded by dentine and is contained in a rigid compartment functions of pulp the dental pulp has the following functions at late bell stage the cells at the Periphery of the pulp differentiate into odontoblasts forming dentine. It provides nutrients to the odontoblasts. Trophic function. It acts as a sensory organ especially when dentine is exposed. The pulp rapidly responds to stimuli such as caries and attrition by laying down reparative or reactionary dentine. Reparative function. It mobilizes defense cells when bacteria enter it. Protective function cells proliferating in the pulpal tissue create pressure. This is thought to play a part in tooth eruption. Periodontal ligament, teeth, structure, primary teeth, permanent teeth, tooth function, incisor. Incisor is a tooth that has one root function to cut and cut off food. 2. Canine. Canines are the teeth that have one root and has the function to rip the food. 3. Premolar. Teeth that had two, one roots, used to grind and chew food. 4. Molar. Molar tooth is a tooth that has two, three roots, have a function for crushing and chewing food. Morphological differences between primary and permanent teeth. There are numerous differences between the primary and permanent dentition, many of which give rise to considerations in relation to operative treatment. Essentially, primary teeth have a shorter crown, a lighter color, narrower occlusal surfaces, thinner enamel and dentine, relatively larger pulps, curved roots to accommodate the developing permanent successor, numbering systems, universal, national system developed in 1968 most commonly used in the United States Federación Dentaire Internacional System Canada and European countries use this easily adapted by computer and is widely used in most countries Palmer System Universal Numbering System A system is used in the United States called the Universal System. This is a two-digit system but the teeth are numbered from 1 through to 32 in a clockwise direction starting with the upper right third molar, right 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 1, 0, 1, 1, 1, 2, 1, 3, 1, 4, 1, 5, 1, 6, upper lower 3, 2, 3, 1, 3, 0, 2, 9, 2, 8, 2, 7, 2, 6, 2, 5, 2, 4, 2, 3, 2, 2, 2, 1, 2, 0, 1, 9, 1, 8, 1, 7, left. ISO, FDI numbering system. The mouth is divided into four quadrants and each quadrant is given a number, starting with the upper right quadrant and working in a clockwise direction. For example, the upper left quadrant is two. The teeth are then allocated a number starting from the midline, so all central incisors are one and all third molars are eight. Therefore the lower right second premolar is 45. Right one eight one seven one six one five one four one three one two one one two one two 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 three two four two five two six two seven two eight upper lower four eight four seven four six four five four 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 three four two four one three one three two three 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 four three five three six three seven three eight left Palmer notation system. In this system, the dentition is divided into quadrants and the teeth in each quadrant are numbered 1 to 8 starting at the midline. Each quadrant is separated by a vertical line for right and left and by a horizontal line for upper and lower. Thus, 6 is the upper left FIRST molar in the permanent dentition. Right 8765432112345678 upper lower 8765432112345678 left. Universal national numbering and lettering system. Maxillary right, maxillary left, mandibular left, mandibular right. Federación Dentaire Internacional system for 
numbering maxillary right quadrant 1 maxillary left quadrant 2 mandibular left quadrant 3 mandibular right quadrant 4 palmar system for numbering maxillary right quadrant maxillary left quadrant mandibular left quadrant mandibular right quadrant overview ergonomics and health implications for dental hygienists increase awareness decrease work related pain and injuries heighten productivity improve musculoskeletal health increase comfort improve quality of life extend careers what is ergonomics ergonomics is the study of workers and their relationship with their occupational environment how you position yourself your patient how equipment is utilized how the workplace is designed and how it impacts your health ergonomics is a way to work smarter more efficiently with less effort and discomfort to the human body ergonomics in the dental health field studies show work-related pain in the dental field is not decreasing over half of all dental professionals continue to experience work-related pain. Why? The physically challenging nature of the work with numerous risk factors. Risk factors prolonged static postures repetitive movements working in a confined space challenges with positioning yourself or the patient limitations with the tools and equipment used. Consequences of poor ergonomics fatigue pain discomfort illness injury missed days at work errors lower productivity patient dissatisfaction poor ergonomics signs and symptoms physical signs decreased range of motion deformity decreased grip strength loss of muscle function symptoms pain numbness tingling burning cramping stiffness poor ergonomics equals musculoskeletal disorders the World Health Organization definition, musculoskeletal disorder is a disorder of the muscles, tendons, peripheral nerves or vascular system not directly resulting from an acute trauma or instantaneous event. Two most common causes for musculoskeletal disorders in the dental health profession, cumulative traumas, prolonged static postures. Cumulative trauma, repetitive movements like scaling and polishing are cumulative. Traumas vibrations transmitted by dental handpieces or mechanical scalers are cumulative. Traumas cumulative traumas add up these microtraumas.